get to know someone like you someone like you i want you to know me because i know then you'll see Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be telling you guys a couple of my favorite beauty and lifestyle things. It's kind of a mishmash of products that I'm in love with right now. And I really just thought it would be fun to sit down and film this and tell you guys everything that I'm loving right now. So with that being said, I am going to link this whole look, this whole makeup look on my Instagram page. So if you guys are you know, wondering any of the products that I'm wearing, uh, go to my Instagram page. I'll link it down below. But the handle is at x o m e l l a b l o g underscore at x o m e l a b l o g underscore. And if you guys like my channel, please subscribe to it. Please like this video if you like it. Give it a thumbs up and share this video with any of your friends who might want to see what I'm loving right now for spring and the beginning of March and all these fun things that are coming into the air. I have some really great lifestyle and beauty products that you guys will love. I'm gonna start off with a set. So I got this for Christmas. This is a gel nail polish UV light. So it's Sun UV is the brand. It looks like this. I just took um, the cord out of it so that I could show you guys, but it looks just like that. And I got some of the gel nail polish products. So this is the foundation. This is the top it off. And this is the pH bond, which you have to use before you um, do anything, you use the pH bond, then you use the foundation, then you apply the color, then you apply the foundation and you're good to go. So I wanted to share that with you guys because it has saved me so much money. I used to be going to the nail salon at least every week and a half and I was spending 30, $40 on manicures and this has saved me so much money. With getting married, I wanted to cut costs where I could and this was an important one. I have my favorite color here. So this is the color Pink Smoothie and it's just the Jellish brand. Um, I usually only use that brand. I get everything off of Amazon. The bottles are about $13 or $14, but in the grand scheme of things, that's nothing compared to what you're spending weekly, so you just have to think long term. I really highly recommend that. I think the biggest takeaway that I have taken from being able to have my own at-home gel nail polish kit is the fact that I don't have to set an appointment. I don't have to break my day out between my nail appointment. I can do it before bed. I can do it when I wake up. I I don't have to go anywhere. I can do it in the comfort of my own home. And that has been amazing for me. I know anyone with a busy schedule, you know, you might think you don't want to do your own nails, but when you can do it at home with your dogs, drinking a glass of wine in front of the TV after a long day, and you don't have to worry about not making it to the nail salon before it closes, you will be very happy that you have a gel nail polish kit. Going back and forth between beauty and lifestyle, I have this foundation that I tried in my last drugstore video. This is Maybelline's Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation. I use the shade 128 and it's a pretty good match. I have extremely oily skin, so I struggle with it all the time. This foundation is $6 at Walmart and it is one of the best foundations I've ever used. I have never gotten more compliments on the way my makeup looks or anything like that than I did with this. I decided to do a drugstore tutorial because it was kind of out of my comfort zone so I just went to the drugstore and I loaded up a basket full of makeup that I wanted to try and this was one of my favorites. I was so impressed with this foundation. I think if you can spend six dollars on a foundation why not? Like go where the money is saved and the skin looks beautiful. So this is definitely highly recommended and Exomela blog approved. My next product is the Jergens Natural Glow Wet Skin Moisturizer. It looks like this. You can get it anywhere. You can get it at Ulta. You can get it at Walmart, wherever you shop. And the reason I like this is because it's not a self tanner, but it'll give you a tint after you get out of the shower. You can just put it on and you don't have to worry about turning orange. It just gives you a glow. And that's all that I ever want. I don't want to self tan. I don't want to do any of that because I don't like to take the chance of looking orange or, you know, blotchy. With this, you can apply it and you don't have to worry about looking blotchy or anything like that. And I feel like once spring comes around, you want to start looking glowy and maybe a little bit more tan or anything that you want to look. This is a great, great product to use if you're looking to do something like that. This next one is a little bit different. I don't normally show you guys these types of things, but this is a bag that I recently got. So this is my Michael Kors tote. It's in this bubblegum pink color. Um, it's really big like if you're planning a wedding or anything like that or you're you have a lot of papers or just a lot to carry around with you through your day this bag is amazing I can't stop looking at it I just love the color I love everything about it um, I did invest in the matching wallet because 
Let me grab that for you guys. Through the mess of things that I have in here. So this is what the matching wallet looks like. Um, I just think the color is so springy and I really need a springy purse. All of my purses are olive green and gold and they're all more wintry tones. So I really wanted to get something that was a little bit more summery and springy and I can wear this bag with anything. And the thing that I love about it is I like big purses. I have a lot to carry around with me on a daily basis. I'm going from this place to this place and I'm never in one place. So I love this tote for that reason. I feel like I can get everything I need in it and I'm not losing things. It's not you know, big and unorganized. It's just big and holds everything that I need to hold. So I highly recommend if you're looking for a tote, I wanted to tell you guys because I don't go shopping for myself a lot. When I go shopping, I'm looking for other people. But if you guys like these kind of tones, you know, the pinks, the light pinks, and you're looking for something for spring, that's a really good place to get a very springy color purse. And it just makes me so happy. Every time I take it to go out the door, I'm like, ah! Another thing that I'm really loving right now is the Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick by L'Oreal. It is in the shade Cowboy. I'm wearing it right now. I just think that it's so pretty and I love the shade and I love the way that it looks on my lips. I feel like I don't need a lip liner. I don't need anything. I can throw it on and go about my day. It doesn't smudge. It doesn't get on your teeth. It doesn't do anything crazy like that. And it's super affordable. It's drugstore and it's beautiful and they have so many shades. So if you're looking for a new matte liquid lipstick and you want something that's going to stay, make your lips look plump and just beautiful then this is your new drugstore lipstick this is kind of random it's jewelry that I love but this is a bangle that I got from Francesca's and I don't know if you guys can kind of see it um, it's got all the spring colors it has coral gold silver taupe you know ivory all those colors and it just goes like this and it's got olive green in it and if you guys can see it I'll even put it on my wrist to show you guys I fell in love with it the second I saw it and I had to have it I'm always looking for unique jewelry finds so I had to show you guys this because I just think it's so beautiful and I love unique jewelry I love things that are different that you can't find everywhere so if you guys are looking for something like that it's on francescas.com my next little lifestyle hack type thing is this cute little makeup bag it's got little eyelashes on it I love anything with eyelashes on it I think it's just so girly and cute and this is just you know put any little makeup that you need that you you don't mind getting it dirty inside the bag and you can throw it in your purse and go about your day if your lipstick gets on it or if anything gets on it you're okay you're not ruining the inside of your purse you're just you know getting your bag a little dirty and this is cloth so you can wash it you can take a tie to go stick to it you can do anything you need so this is just a cute little travel makeup bag they're from Hobby Lobby and if you guys are looking for something that you can really get your makeup in and go about your day not worry about it leaking or you know getting any colors on it then this is your go-to next is this wake play slay planner if you guys follow me on Instagram you saw this I'm obsessed with this planner it's for 2018 it goes all the way through I love it for a lot of reasons it's just you know of course it's really cute and it has you know each month and with each month comes a little cute quote and you can write your notes and your goals your birthdays January anniversaries it gives you not only a full calendar layout but also a day-by-day -day breakdown which is also really helpful it helps you stay organized write down when certain bills are due write down anything that you need to remember people's birthdays you know there's a lot of birthdays in certain months and you gotta write it down and remember you know February's quote and then it's really cute because in the beginning of it it has all of these cute little stickers that you can place all over the month so you know reminder take note best day ever get it done hair appointment vacation doctors early start it's just a cute way to make your life a little bit more fun I'm all about making life more organized easier funner less stressful all those things that's what I'm here for that's what I'm trying to do you know I'm just a 20 something girl trying to make it through and figure out my way through life and I've done my best in life when I'm organized when I have cute little lifestyle things that make me happy you know if a planner can make you happy if a new bag can make you happy if a new lipstick can make you happy then you need to invest in it and spend time on yourself and spend money on yourself so that's what this video is all about just make yourself happy so this is from Francesca's and it's so cute and I love it
Next product is the Flowery Beauty. This is the Satin Finishing Powder Miracle Glow. So it just looks like this. I used it in my drugstore tutorial. It's just a setting powder, but it's a satin Miracle Glow setting powder. So it does make your skin glow a little bit when you set your makeup with it. I did not use it today, so I'm not wearing it. But the reason I really like this is because it's your drugstore. And if you have oily skin and you have to use matte foundations and you put on your concealer and you want to set it with something that's going to give it a little bit of a sparkly finish or, you know, a glowy finish, this is your go-to. Um, it's nothing super drastic, but you can definitely tell a difference than if you were to set it with just like a mattifying setting powder. So I think the Satin Glow Setting Powder is just a really cute touch if you're going out or something and you want your skin to glow a little bit, then definitely try out that finishing powder. It's not going to mattify your skin, so if you really are super oily and you need a matte, um, setting powder then maybe set your face with a matte setting powder and maybe put a little bit of that over it so that you don't have to worry about it but I definitely think it's worth a try if you are looking for something in that kind of genre next thing that I'm obsessed with this month is the Milani blush this is in blossom time rose and I just love this so much I never thought I could love a drugstore blush so much I'm wearing it right now it's not super pronounced but you can definitely kind of see it um, I think it's because my highlighter is super pronounced right now. This is the Maybelline Master Chrome that I'm wearing. But this Milani blush is beautiful. It does the job. I like it as much as I like some of my $30 blushes. So I think if you're looking for something that's drugstore, I think I like this more than my high end, to be perfectly honest. I think it's so cute. It's a flower, if you can kind of see. And it's affordable. You can get it at Walmart. You don't have to go anywhere special to get it. And I just think it does the job. I love a coral blush. My skin tone doesn't do well with reds. It doesn't do well with super pinky ones either. But it likes coral, you know. I'm not a big blush girl. But I feel like this blush is definitely something that I'm loving. Because it just gives you just enough blush. And lastly, I'm saving the best for last. I mentioned these in my last video. These are the Peach Exfoliating Sugar Cubes by Harper and Ari. They are cubes that you take with you in the shower and they're supposed to be used just to exfoliate your skin and you're only supposed to use them a couple times a week. I use them all the time because I'm obsessed with them. These are $24 at Francesca's. Um, you can check their website, follow them on Instagram. It's Harper and Ari. You can find them. I've linked them in some of my Instagram stories. So if you guys want the exact link, I can link it down below. But I just think that this is such a good invention. If you guys have dry skin in the winter and you're looking for something that's going to soften it but still exfoliate, these are your exfoliating cubes. There's something really good about having a natural exfoliation and these sugar cubes do that for you. They have all different kinds. They do different kinds than peach that's just the kind that I got but you can always check out their website because I know they have different um, scents of the, the cubes the directions are just to take a single cube with you in the shower or bath and gently massage it over wet skin concentrating on rough patches recommended use is twice a week or whenever you need some extra pampering it's for your body only so don't use it on your face it's not recommended but I highly recommend those to you guys. I am I love them. I wouldn't recommend something that was $24 if I didn't think it was worth $24. I have had them for a couple weeks now and I still have a ton left. So definitely they are worth the investment. Just try them once if you don't like them after that. You don't ever have to buy them again. But I think that they are worth the money and I think they are worth you guys trying. So that's all that I have for you guys today. I appreciate you guys watching and I just want to thank you guys so much for always supporting me and commenting and liking and subscribing it means a lot to me i hope you guys enjoyed my favorites for right now and the fact that i included a lot of affordable things in it i'm trying to get more into drugstore makeup i'm hoping to do a ton with drugstore makeup in the future so i'm really excited to just keep branching out of my comfort zone and trying new products because clearly it worked very well for me last time if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram at exomelablog underscore i hope you guys have an amazing weekend. I have a ton that is coming for you in the next week as far as videos so stay tuned. Hit the bell to make sure that you never miss one of my videos and just follow me on social media so that you guys get updated when I do post a video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again in my next video.